Kong. This is a match I had in the Panzer 470, where I used my guide on how I recommend to play this vehicle and my map tactics for this map. I destroyed 13 vehicles using this tactics. You can find both videos linked in the description. Before I spawn into a match I asked myself, what is my BPM? B stands for battle rating and the initial spawn cost of the Panzer 470 tell me that this is a full up tier match. P stands for purpose of my tank and normally I would play with any other tank only as support. But the Panzer 470 can also brawl in up tiers. M is for map and the map we got is Carpathians with domination. So I pick my brawl route for this map and move to my first key position. As mentioned in my map tactics, the capture point on the hill is crucial for the outcome of the match. When you climb the hill from this side of the map you actually want to use the path that leads up to the hill. In this match I take advantage of the low height of the Panzer 470 and take a shortcut. But I always have an eye on that area, because this is a popular spot for the enemy side. I reach the archway on the hill but my teammates are still behind me. The bra route absolutely needs the help of the support route here. That's why I don't drive through the archway yet. In addition I recommend to play the Panzer 470 like a casemate. That means I have to brawl from the second row. It has a good armor to draw attention to itself but you need flank protection. An enemy was highlighted on the minimap. I used a good mobility and attacked the enemy to hopefully clear the left side here. In the meantime a player in the Tiger H1 has also arrived at my position. Unfortunately this is the wrong route for him. But a Tiger H1 this is also a full up tier match and the player would have rather chosen my recommended support route. The weak spots of the Tiger H1 are too prominent to brawl directly with the enemy. The Tiger H1 is under attack by an enemy and I can't really help it without risking being destroyed myself. But I have to do something even if there is still no teammate on the support position on my left side. This can be really dangerous. Thanks to the good gun I can take out the first enemy quickly. But of course at this very moment I'm being shot at from the left side. As already said, the key position 1 for the support route is enormously important on this map. The good hull traverse, the low height and good armor of the Panzer 470 as well as some luck helped me here. Now that the teammate is on the support route we can take care of the capture point. But in front of me I can still hear the engine of an enemy. You can brawl with the Panzer 470, but you have to make sure that you always hide the lower front plate behind solid cover. You can assume that you are hull down when the crosshair aligns with the ground in front of you. While my teammate and I take care of the remaining enemies around the capture point, let's have a look at the minimap. At the moment my team is getting spawn camped by the enemy. When you capture C, you don't want to drive all the way through to the enemy spawn. Help your team and take care of the capture point B or defend C. The same goes for the hill I'm on right now. From here you can completely overlook the enemy's spawn, but that just breaks the game. It's better to focus on the area below the hill and fight the enemies there. This will also help your own team get back into the match. Now that the capture point A is clear we can take the big advantage of the position on the hill. I skipped the second key position for the brawl route because I had to push the enemies. The third key position is either beyond the capture point or like in this situation above B. From here you can perfectly shoot on the enemies that try to get beyond B or the capture point C. The low profile and fast reload of the Panzer 470 are very useful. Be sure to use some rocks as cover when reloading. Listen for enemy engines and check the minimap from time to time. As of now, I'll let you enjoy a few encounters and get back to you later.
so far I've already taken out 11 enemies. In the next situation I will shoot with binoculars. The gun of the Panzer 470 is so powerful that you don't necessarily have to aim at the enemy's weak spot. Whenever I play such a tank, I use this technique to take out enemies even though I can't see them through the gunner's perspective. My team has finally managed to take out the spawn campers and can now clear and capture C. But now my team is surrounded in front of me and I have to help them. A is being cleared and I hear an engine to my left, so there must be an enemy there. In the next situation I can hear a Russian engine to my right. And as I adjust the hull of my casemate tank towards this enemy, I get destroyed from the left. My mistake was that I was too aggressive and gave the enemy a chance to shoot at my side. In the end we lost the game but I had 13 kills, which is amazing. I hope I was able to give you some tips and my guides will help you. Like, subscribe and leave a comment if you want to and check out my Discord server for more information and to connect with other players. Hope to see you in game soon.